So this is the uh, <clears throat> the new build, the Jimbo Rezo Phonic uh, cigar box, four string cigar box guitar. Uh, it's got a mahogany body, uh, a lovely old uh, box it is with the original clasps, uh, which I've used of course. <coughs> um, <coughs> we've got uh, the whole sound holes obviously. The gentleman who, who commissioned it upon <coughs> me wanted corners, so I've put corners on for him. Uh, this is a, a resophonic uh, uh, um, cone and cover. That's a chicken bone John one. They're very good then. The only problem with these is that if you want to adjust anything inside or you want to take things to bits, you've got to take all the strings off and prat about because this doesn't unscrew. Now, if that unscrewed, you could take that off and prat about a bit easier, but it doesn't. So that's a drag. Uh, we've got a humbucker pickup, uh, a bronze, uh, again it's a chicken bone John one I've used this time uh, because it all matches with the, the hardware you see. Um, so inside we've got uh, the, the cone which has got a pizza stuck to it and a pizza control. We've got two outputs so this is the, the sound of the reson resonator. <laughs> Player, as you know, so I'll have a little go with this just to piss about. Um, uh, um, I, I can't play slide, so but um, so. Not even it's not even tuned on iTunes, so I'm struggling to play it. Um, this is tuned normal G D G B. I don't tune like that. I tune uh, G D B and a high G to do all my little ragtime stuff. So it doesn't really work for me this tuning, but I've tuned it as as you normally should, I guess. You know. But consequently, it's screwing up my playing. Now, if we just talk uh, about. So we've got an output for the resophonic there. Now the neck is uh, mahogany, maple, and ebony, um, and same with the headstock. Uh, different variations of those woods and bronze tuners, as you can see. Um, and an ebony fretboard. It's got Jeskar Evo Gold uh, frets, which I always use the Evo Gold. It's got a bone nut and a bone saddle. Came with a maple saddle down here. She came with a maple saddle, which I thought was crap. But they're always d a bit dull to me. I don't know why. I don't know, you know. So I like to use bone. So I always replace them with bone. Um, and then it's got the usual dots and side dots. So that's the, the Jimbo resonator. Let's plug in the, the humbucker, which is around the other. I've recessed the, the, um, the inputs, of course. There you go, and this is the the, the humbucker side of things. So put some nastiness on there. Again, I can't really play these things very well. That's the humbucker, and uh, so you've got two two outputs: resonator and humbucker, which you can you know have that going to a PA or something, and that going to your amp or two amps or two channels on you know whatever you want really. Uh, 
And that's it. The the traditional. Don't forget to put the the dollar bill seal on Lee. <laughs> and and that's my little label. So I hope you enjoy that little build. Sorry I can't play them better, but uh, you know me. I like to do the ragtime thing, and it's all tuned wrong for me. This, and I'm not really a slide player. So uh, happy days. Thanks for looking.